Well, Jimmy Butler off to a great start after missing the last game out due to some back tightness. He has come in, he's played with great energy, attacking off the dribble, looking to set up his teammates, but also finish baskets like that himself. Five points, couple of assists, finding cutters as the Magic continue to turn their heads on the ball penetration. Uh, Jimmy using that physicality at such a high level here early. Kelly, I heard you're with one of his top fans down there. <laughs> That's right. He's sitting courtside. He's got a massive smile on his face. He came all the way from Argentina. We all know the story by now. To watch Jimmy Butler play on Tuesday was so disappointed when he found out he wasn't in the starting lineup. But guys, that disappointment did not last for long. The Heat took care of him. They sprang into action. He received a jersey, a signed ball, got a picture of Gabe Vincent, and got a chance to see Jimmy Butler and spend time with him after the game. An awesome story. Love seeing him here tonight. Hero out to Vincent. The corner three. Kaboom. Oh, every little bit helps. And Miami needs a lot of help from downtown. Coming right at the Heat defense. Fultz an open three. He doesn't shoot many of those. You can see why. Heat on a four-on-one break. A hero fake from three. And a runner that drops. I like that. Tyler Hero being selective. The threes have not been so friendly to him late. Fourth pick in 89. And Steve Smith and D. Wade, the number five pick. I think that he did very well with those two selections. I'll tell you what, Ben Carroll looked like he got a hold of one of your old purple suits there on draft night. Eh? Oh, I agree. You would say, okay, well, the quality of the shots is, is much less. But that's not been the case. There's been a lot of open threes like this here from Struess. And there we go. Great triple handoff action there by Bam on the setting up Magic. The Magic ahead by eight. But both teams have had eight-point leads here in the first half. Struess from three. Kaboom. Oh, that's good news. Max Struess bombing away. Had problems staying healthy, but if he can get there, he's another quality young player for them. The Magic ahead by nine. Hero hits another flip. Tyler's having trouble from three, but he's connecting from in the paint. 29 lead after one quarter. They shot 56% in that game and never trailed. They're playing well again tonight. Ahead by 10. Hero on the catch and go. Bounces off. Hero ran it down, and the Heat get another 14 on the shot clock to work with. Jimmy. Struess to the paint. Found Butler, who hung in the air long enough to hit. Nine points for Butler with a game high 14 points. Magic ahead by nine. They were down eight in the first quarter. Butler knocks it down on the move. You could see Jonathan Isaac back tonight. He, he had missed two and a half seasons after tearing his ACL. A couple of you know, August of 2020. What a remarkable comeback for him. He's sitting out tonight for injury management. Butler, oh, that ends up being a three-point possession for him. A Jimmy Butler. Miami regularly wins the points in the paint battle, but the inefficiency out beyond the arc makes it tough. To score. That's a goaltend on Wendell Carter Jr., and that's what happens when Jimmy Butler gets that close. Yeah. A 16-point first half for Butler. And the ball fake is what sets it up, head and shoulders, and the ball fake gets the defense overcommitted there, and he's able to draw that goaltend. No, Miami plus 10 in the paint, minus 9 from three-point line. Cole Anthony. Bancaro missed the bank shot. Here comes Jim. Under a minute left in the second quarter. Butler turning his back on the smaller Cole Anthony. Oh, he missed it. Got him right where he wanted him and then missed. This is Bancaro, quick move against Shrews. You see Lowry come to help, then try to recover, but Harris got free. And the rebound finally bounces to Lowry. Look at that hit ahead to Shrews. Butler hammered it down. Well, Jimmy will get the highlight, but it was all triggered by that lightning quick outlet by Kyle Lowry. Four in the second quarter. Jimmy getting after it here in transition on top of the basket. Carter Jr. surprises him. Boom, on top of the rim with that two-hand crusher.